Hey everyone, Rob Gagne here with Bovido. Welcome to another episode of Unboxed, and this is a special holiday theme. What I'm trying to achieve here is understanding how do we give cigars this holiday season? I've had this question asked to me many times in retail, and it's always interesting how people approach it. But with the fact that some of these shops are either limiting their space and or um, you may not have a brick and mortar in your area, I'm gonna hopefully help you understand how to get closer to buying cigars and gifting them this holiday season. So the first thing that I always ask people is what are you trying to achieve as far as giving a gift of cigars? And what do you wanna do with it? Do you want the cigars to be quality over quantity? Do you want a cigar that's going to be strength? Or, you know, how are you looking for this? Like strength, are you looking for a gift with purchase? And I have so much stuff surrounding me, there's even more stuff behind me. We're gonna kind of go through it all. Um, I've always said in retail that if you have a price point in mind, it makes it a lot easier. And if you have a brick and mortar in your area that can help you out, definitely ask them their opinion. But you can go as simple as just giving a couple of cigars. You could buy cigars anywhere, whether it be online or brick and mortar, buy a small Boveda humidor bag, put them in it, and put them in your gift bag, and you are literally done. You've solved the problem of how do I keep these cigars fresh for whoever I'm giving them to? And more importantly, maybe the person that you're giving them to doesn't smoke cigars on a regular and they may not have a humidor. This solves a huge problem of, well, I don't want them to go bad and I don't want to ruin out on my gift giving. And I think this also provides a cool value in gift wrapping, right? It's a humidor, it lasts for a whole year. And as a consumer, you can use it multiple times. So as soon as I'm done with these two cigars, I can put more in it, take it with me on the go. But that's what Bovid is all about, making it easy, right? But let's dive deeper into the gift giving season. So if you're giving a couple of cigars, easy, small humidor bag. Now, if you wanted to give like a five pack, let's say you were going to buy a five pack of cigars. These are from Crux, great presentation, beautiful cigars. Um, of course, there's a bunch of companies that do this, uh, whether it be Crux or Davidoff is another one that has some great five packs. Winston Churchill, you know, these are, I don't know, anywhere between 50 and 100 bucks. Great gift giving guide. The presentation is nice. Like, if you think about it, the presentation of a five pack is almost like buying a box because you have the nice, uh, kind of rigid edges, you feel like you're getting something more than just like a couple of sticks in a bag. You're getting kind of closer to a full box purchase here. And I've always liked the feel of this in the presentation. And I always go to grab these whenever I'm doing events or I'm having social gatherings because the presentation of this is just above and beyond something else. And again, like I said, there's other companies that do this really well. Crux and Davidoff are one of my favorites that do this really well. The presentation is always um, easy. I mean, look at that. The box is already perforated and just perfectly displayed. You can throw your whole box inside one of our Boveda medium humidor bags, and you're gonna have you know, whether it's this or a couple of these, and you said you wanted to gift these, take the Boba to medium humidor bag, toss them in there. Now you got a humidor with great presentation to give somebody, toss it in your bag, put a bow on it, you're good to go. So again, these five packs are amazing. And again, depending upon the cigar, the price point can be super affordable. Most of the time when I was in retail, people were asking me, yeah, I want to spend, you know, 50 to 100 bucks. That's great. Now I automatically know kind of where to put you at. So I like this. I love giving gifts this way. Super affordable, great presentation. Hands down, let me know if you guys have any cigar companies that you think do great five-pack presentations other than the ones I have listed. Share those companies out there and let's see what's going on. Now, besides the five-pack, you can move up into the gift sets. And I got a bunch of different gift sets behind me and really what it is is 
a lot of companies put together cigar gift sets that come with a free package. So, Romeo y, y Julieta um, makes a great uh, pack here for you to sample. This has four of the um, Nicaraguan and four of the Reserve. Um, the Dominican and Nicaraguan Romeos back to back. This is retailing right at $69.83. So another great price point, good presentation. And again, if you got your Bovo to medium humidor bag, it will totally fit. You just slide it in there and you're good to go. Um, that was the number one concern that I always got in retail was, how do I make sure these stay fresh for whoever I'm giving them to? And that's important. Um, next, this is a bigger sampler, two of the pretty much every single type of Romeo. We got the Nika 1875, the Reserva Real, we got the Reserva, and we also have the 1875. I think I got them all. Packaged with Bovida, but again, putting it inside that medium humidor bag is definitely gonna make sure it lasts a lot longer. And if your guest that you're giving them to doesn't have a humidor, you've got them covered with a very inexpensive $8 bag. So, Super easy to do. Buy it either at a retailer near you or obviously you can buy it at bobadink.com. These are fun gift ideas, great samplings. You get a multitude of cigars to try. It's a great opportunity. Next, we also have kind of this one I'm kind of interested in a lot just because this has the cigar of the year, the Aging Room Nicaraguan. This was the cigar of the year. Um, it also has the Nicaraguan series from Monte Cristo, which was number 10 cigar of the year. Great sampler pack, cool presentation. At 61 bucks, this is a great deal. Um, you just get to try a lot of different stuff. I also like on the back, it gives the radians 90, 91, 96, all these different radians that these cigars had. And you learn a little bit about, you know, I didn't even know this Onyx Bold was using a broadleaf wrapper. I had no idea. Learn that from this packaging. It's a great opportunity to try a few cigars from Altidus and their brands. They also have Cooler gifts with purchases, whether it be a flask or rocks glasses or this, a Moscow Mule glass, you're basically getting, and it can be anywhere from like four, five, all the way up to 10, 12 cigars. Just depends upon the sampler. But this one comes in at $52.50. Pretty great presentation. The packaging is great. The presentation is great. And again, this would fit in our large humidor bag if you wanted to humidify it and give it to somebody, boom. Slip it right in there, great gift. I also have some other things that I'm looking at where they're more sampler packs for maybe that person that you know absolutely loves Monte Cristo Nicaraguan series. You can get a nice box presentation of five cigars Great opportunity, 65 bucks. Love this as well. This is similar to like those five packs that I was talking about, those sleeves. Just a great presentation. Again, that extra added detail to packaging during the holiday season is always nice. But if you don't have that, that's why the Bovida Humidor Bag or the Medium Humidor Bag can provide you some level of that. But let's be honest, it's not the same level as this. This is a very high-end gift-giving packaging design. This is a answer to how the heck do I keep these cigars fresh and they don't dry out before I give them to somebody and how do they keep them fresh after they get them and they don't have to quick hurry up and smoke them all. That's why I'm a big fan of obviously both of these, but the Boba de Humidor bag is that solution to how do I keep these cigars fresh. This is the solution to how do I look good when giving these cigars as a gift to somebody. I also like, this is one of my favorite, the Espiritu Sante um, or Espiritu um, by Trinidad. This is a great cigar, love this. This is all sorts of different sizes in here. You got the Bellicosa, the Magnum, uh, the Robusto Toro, and 
Formidad, uh, whichever that is, I believe that is our Fundaro. Apologize if I don't know the size, but coming in at, this is $52. Great, great opportunity. Again, package with Bova to put it inside a medium humidor bag and you're good to go. Give this gift. I love the presentation on this. Now, maybe you have somebody who really enjoys high-end cigars or you just want to treat somebody to a high-end cigar that they really wouldn't probably purchase themselves. Xeno Platinum came out with these coffin boxes of the Xeno Platinum Z Crown. This cigar alone is 100 bucks retail, so this wouldn't be like an everyday smoker to me. I mean, Davidoff has certain cigars that are like this, but this is just a nice presentation that you're able to do, grab the medium or the small humidor bag, put it inside there, and again, it's the holiday season, it's a gift. It's something that I probably wouldn't pick up every day and or smoke. So being able to gift this to somebody and have them smoke a $100 cigar and say that they did, whether they enjoyed it or not is entirely up to them. I think more importantly is if that's what you're trying to achieve as far as a gift, that rarity, that obvious um, have a special cigar on me, that's a nice thing to do. I mean, we can argue till the cows come home on whether or not it's justified in the $100 price point. But at the end of the day, um, if somebody gave me this, I'd thank them heavily and say, appreciate the gift, smoke it and uh, enjoy it and savor it. So those are my kind of top gift um, giving gifts this season, getting a gift with it, having a good presentation. I like that. I still have more to go through this um, season. Obviously, we've all been kind of shut in, and I'm looking at um, the Davidoff. They have a great nine premium cigar sampler ba uh, box here. This, uh, let's see what it looks like on the inside. This is running right at 180 bucks. Uh, for these nine cigars, so definitely not cheap. So we're approaching that, you know, if you're getting under a hundred bucks, I just kind of went through that. If you want to get higher and get like, you know, anywhere between a hundred and 200 bucks, now we're getting into that price point. Um, the presentation, of course, with Davidoff is never second to none. Um, you got an info card here that tells you everything about the cigar as far as the size and its name. And it also tells you how long it should smoke for. You know, it's giving you 50 minutes, 45 minutes, 25 minutes, all that kind of stuff. Um, interestingly enough, I love the fact that this is all wood. Great presentation. Every single cigar is cellowed and easily presentable. This slides right into our large humidor bag. Great gift. Um, something for somebody to cherish throughout the year and or experiment with other blends that they've never had from Davidoff. If you know they like a certain brand and you give them this sampler, why not? Now they can try different ones and go, hey, wow, I really, really liked and appreciated the Millennium Blend. I used to only smoke the um, Special R, but I, I realized that I like a little bit more darker uh, of a wrapper. That is and again, putting these back together, holy cow, not easy because they are gifts meant to be given once, package taken apart. So that's the Davidoff sampler pack of nine. They have another one that has 12 cigars, but this one I picked because it was just under 200 bucks. So like that one, good sampler pack. Now, Fuente also has one. This is the 2020 Holiday Collection. Uh, just wanted to check this out and see what this is all about because again, if it's Fuente, I know it's gonna be something that I wanna definitely smoke. Um, and if you guys have been checking out social media, they got the rare pinks coming out as well. That is a th opportunity to support breast cancer awareness. Um, and again, their presentation is always amazing. You, you have the Fuente, the, this paper is always beautiful. And in here, protected by Bovida, you got the Fuente pack, the Humida pack that they always have that's made by us to help protect it. You got the story behind it all that tells you exactly what's going on um, and what they've been doing, signed by Carlito. And here it is. You got a couple of Opus, you got some white label, you have pretty much a great sampling. 
This again coming at an, in at 146 bucks. Some Hemingways. Um, I don't even know. Double Chateaus. Uh, double Chateaus. Four Double Chateaus. A Magnum R in the white label. And then two of the 20 year anniversary Opus X blue labels. Phenomenal presentation on that. And again, this fits in a Boveda Large Humidor uh, bag and all, I mean, obviously it's already protected, but it will last even longer in there if you're worried about, hey, how long can this person sit on these cigars? Uh, put it in a, a large humidor bag and you're good to go. But this is what it's all about for me for the holiday season. Receiving something that's a little bit more rare, a little bit more, um, I wouldn't normally buy this myself. I love giving people that opportunity to try cigars like that. Or um, you can just go ahead and buy a whole box of cigars. Like I got here and just put it inside a large humidor bag and there you go. If you know somebody likes a certain type of cigar and that's all they smoke, why deviate? Just get them that box of cigars and here you go. So box of cigars, can't tell you the price point on this because it could be anywhere. It could be anywhere from uh, less than $200 and it could be anywhere from all the way up to uh, several hundred dollars just because of the brands out there and the variations. So one of my favorite ways to give cigars if I know somebody is just jonesing for one type of cigar and I know they smoke a lot of it, I'm going to give them this easy way to present it. It's in a Boveda humidor. It's going to stay in here, uh, a Boveda humidor bag. It's going to stay in here and it's going to last for over a year. Now, what does that mean? It lasts for over a year. The Boveda bag, the pack itself, the brown pack, will keep these cigars humidified for up to a year. And all you have to do is replace that once it dries out. So the bag, as long as it's still intact and not damaged, it's going to keep out all of, or it's going to keep in the humidity and moisture. And it's going to keep out everything that you don't want, like dry air. The smell is going to stay in there. I actually age my cigars in here as well. This bag is way over engineered has the same moisture barrier as a Tupperware container or glass container. Most people don't know that because they just think it's a cheaper Ziploc bag. It's not the case. Polymers and the densities, we could go on for days about that. This is, this is high-end bag. Now, again, the presentation as well, like I said, I like the fact that it's clear on this side so that the customer that are, or the gift givee that I'm giving this to knows these are my cigars and the wrapping is kind of done. I can put this in a, in a bag or I could even tie a bow around this and I'd be totally confident in giving it that way. Um, that's my personal preference on that. I've kind of already gone through this. You can do 10 packs, sampler packs. Again, the Boveda medium humidor bag just solves that problem for you right away. But let's say we have somebody in our life who is, uh, we know they're a cigar smoker, we know that they already smoke cigars and we're not gonna get them cigars, we're gonna try to move towards getting them accessories for their cigars. There's a whole world of stuff and I don't even do it justice here. Uh, I just wanted to touch on it a little bit because obviously there's bunches of different um, accessories out there. You can go with lighters, cutters, and then travel cases, humidors, everything. Of course, the Boveda humidor uh, acrylic humidors, we have a small one here. We also have a large one. You could add the butler to it. The butler allows you to monitor the humidity on your smartphone day and night, provides a line graph. I love this at um, 40 bucks, great deal. Um, the small acrylic humidor at 70 is one of my favorites. And I think in here, I got three rows of these. Uh, I'd say they're about the size of a Toro. Um, so I'd say this holds anywhere from 10 to 20 sticks to paint pound how big it is. So great buy here, love this. Great presentation on a desk. We also have a large, which is going to be much bigger and it's gonna have three spots to hold basically three boxes of cigars. So that's one of my favorite ways to give cigars for somebody who's just getting into it because again, that acrylic humidor allows you to keep these cigars fresh for up to a year. It comes with the Boveda in it already, so you get two Boveda size 60 in it. And again, the presentation, when I set this out on the table and I have friends come over and they pick cigars out of it, it just looks cool. It's a great presentation. And at 70 bucks, so less than 100 bucks, you can get a nice 
set uh, or a nice humidor and a nice uh, a selection of cigars if you wanted to push that to 100 and you're good to go for a gift. All set, ready for the holiday season. Now let's talk about some of these travel humidors. This one's by Project Carbon. I believe these hover right around 250 bucks. They're all leather. Of course, they hold all the accessories and everything you need in it as well. Um, you got from your perfect um, draw to your cigar rest to the accessories that you have for cutter, lighter, and um, yeah, your cutter, like your OXO. Um, I don't even remember what this one's called, but the round one, the OXO cutter um, by Zycar. I think this is called the QX, or, the, or maybe it's the OX, I don't know. Not 100% sure on that, um, but it's a great cutter that I like. Anyways, putting all of these things together Really simple, you got nice uh, presentation. And again, for me, I like it because I can just take out my humidor bag and throw my cigars in it. Again, if you had the small humidor bag, you can just toss it right in there, be good to go. Fold it up and you're on your way. This is a great presentation for any person you know that likes to show up, share cigars with somebody, um, business or not business, it's just a nice way to show, hey, I got some cigars, of course I have a few for somebody else, great presentation, everything's laid out, and again, it looks nice, goes well with anything you got going on. I've used this one, so I apologize if, the, uh, if it doesn't look as good as it should, uh, but I use it, and I like it. 250 bucks for that, that is a great opportunity for somebody that smokes cigars on a regular. You have a less expensive for coming in at under 100 bucks. This is one of the best uh, cigar cases I've seen come out in a while because there's now dividers and compartments to this. We're getting rid of the foam. This is the Pelican. I don't know the name on it. There's probably a product name. I got this one from Oxford Cigar Company. I know there's another company out there called Amador that makes these um, right around $84 unless you start adding accessories to it. Um, accessories include, they're gonna obviously allow you to add things like a lighter, a cutter. If you wanted to add the Bovida Butler, you definitely can do that. I like the fact that this stuff all Velcros down so it's all adjustable. You can Velcro it up or down, secure your hardware, make sure it doesn't drift around. Um, and again, Inside this top lid, you got the Bovida pack. This keeps it up out of the way, um, keeping the valuable real estate down below for any of your cigars that you wanna definitely travel with. Um, I think, depending upon the depth of this, it's a little shallow, so you could probably only get one facing unless you have a skinnier ring gauge cigar like this, Intemperance by Romacraft. Um, but still, I like it. The tray goes on top, again, at around 85 bucks. This is a great gift. It's secure. You can strap it down. It has these nice wide uh, opportunities to strap this to a cooler, strap it to a chair, whatever you need to do. Um, I like this if you're on the go adventure type uh, person or you just want rigid, hard uh, exterior. If you just want simplicity and showcasing a great opportunity to present cigars, I would go with one of these. If, if you can justify the $250 price point, I would definitely do it. This has been one of my favorite ways to travel. And every time I bring it out, people are like, wow, that thing is really nice looking. So now you can kind of mix and match what your gift givee is, what kind of style life they have. You know, do they have the travel humidor that is rigid? Do they need that? Are they kind of the adventure style? or are they more sophisticated, like a better presentation, like a Project Carbon case like this? Um, that's up to you to decide. One of the newer things that came out, on the out recently on the market, I'm not gonna do a full review on this, but I have been playing with it. It is the Voltec Humidor. This has been splashing all over media. Um, at a price point, originally coming out at $400, and now dropping down to 350. Um, it's pushing obviously a leather case um, because a leather case you can get right around 200 to 250 bucks depending upon what you go with. But 
The life pod itself, uh, again, this added level of luxury comes from this case. This case um, is heavy, sturdy, and it has a lot of moving parts. There's some pros and cons. I won't get into all of those right now. I have my personal preference and opinion on, on a lot of this stuff. But vault again, came out with this. Originally, this case was designed to hold um, whatever you basically wanted. Could be jewelry, could be money, could be anything. A lot of what they're known for is making gun safes. Quick on the go gun safes or quick to grab guns. This then was one of those gun safes that you could have. Um, it comes with a wire cord um, that you end up, there's a small hole here it slides in, the wire cord can go around something and then keep it leashed to whatever you have. Um, it's all, you know, it takes a couple of batteries just to do this. Um, you gotta set up a code and then it unlocks. Um, I can redo that if you guys wanna see. The opportunity to lock this, and if you heard it, it locked. It's kinda gratifying to hear that lock and unlock. It's uh, something new that I've never, experience in the cigar world, something that was electronically locking, not locking. Um, it has these nice side clamps. And of course, once you open it, I'll try to give you guys a good presentation. There you have it. Your cigars are securely safe. There is a tray, a cedar tray with humidification meter that shows up on your phone, kind of like the bow with a butler, it just takes up more space than a butler. Um, there's an opportunity, they say, up here for a lighter, but I don't know a ton of lighters that'll fit up there because this is like one of the smallest lighters I have. Um, these are what I typically carry and they don't fit. Um, so that's kind of a bummer for me. Um, not a big fan of like why that isn't bigger because there's just wasted space to me in the background of this. Um, that wasted space, again, can be seen as I totally knock all these out, that wasted space can be seen right in the back here. It's just plastic. So to me, I just almost wanna go in there and kind of remove that so I can get an actual lighter inside there. I do like the fact that this is Velcroed and all the cigars that I go ahead and put in on here, they stay put unless you try to take it out, of course, and move it around. What I don't like is the size of this tray I mean, this is a pretty standard Toro size and it only fits in a couple of the spots because as you notice, I'm gonna to try to do this without tipping all of these over. As you notice, um, this is varying the depth. So you run into a problem with this black piece and this is kind of jagged down at the bottom. You can't get like my Padron Diplomats that I like to smoke. Um, some of the Davidoffs that I like to smoke, I can't get those in there. So this is limited to size of cigar. And that's kind of a downfall for me. I don't particularly like to be limited by what I can and cannot put in my humidor. But again, you're always limited depending upon how small you're going in a case. You got an accessory up here for like a cutter um, if you wanted to put your cutter in there. Um, Obviously, a spot for the Boveda pack to make sure that they, the cigars stay humidified. You can toss one in there as well. Down here, not really usable for me unless you're putting a business card. But again, you have this notch out here. If you put anything thick, it hits this. Not a big fan of that. But if you're looking for this opportunity to safeguard your um, cigars, this is waterproof. This is like, you know, indestructible, you can run over it kind of a thing. And it locks, um, so I don't know really if that's, uh, you don't want anyone else to take your cigars or you just like the fact that you can lock them up. That's entirely up to you. Again, 350 right now on their website. Interesting opportunity to increase our opportunity to travel with cigars and probably do some other functional carrying with this. If you're not carrying cigars in it, you could probably easily put a handgun in here with some foam and do that as well. So multi-versatile there. But anyways, that I wanted to show you from vault -Tec. That's kind of like the high end of what I was thinking for, the gift-giving season. 
Um, don't know if there's any comments out there that anyone has about anything that I should be hitting up. But if you do have any comments about what you love to give this holiday season, let me know. And we can definitely all feed off of each other, get good gift giving ideas this holiday season. Let's see, uh, Scott McDonald said, Bovida is a great product to keep my scars in the correct community. Thank you for everyone at Bovida. You're very welcome. Love the YouTube. Love that you guys love it. Appreciate it. Um, sometimes we just throwing stuff up here and hopefully you guys gravitate towards it because we just want to make sure that you're getting the, the information you want and the service that you need. Um, the boxes of cigars, uh, Bruce said the boxes of cigars are shipped in are not airtight. Uh, if you don't, then uh, if they're not, then you need to put the box in a large humidor bag. Again, that's the main reason why I say this. I mean, boxes of cigars, of course, um, if you're just going to give somebody a, that box right away, you could probably go without humidifying it. I live in Minnesota where it's super dry, and if I give anybody anything, I don't want them to hassle with, how do I keep these fresh? Do I have to quick put these in my humidor? Plus, if you're on the level of giving gift sets like this, it's sometimes nice to keep it in the box. In, in order to keep it in the box and keep it well humidified, I need a large humidor bag in order to do that. If I don't have the large humidor bag, I can't possibly just keep them in the box because I may not have a humidor that would fit all this. So personally, let me grab my large humidor bag. Oh, as I stumble over this too, let's talk about subscriptions. I only have a couple here in my hand. I didn't have a ton of examples, but there are tons out there that package with Bovida, My Cigar Pack, Good Cigar, CigarClub.com, Pravada Cigar Club, Farm Rolled. I mean, all of them. If I missed you, I apologize. There are so many out there. And these subscriptions are so easy to give. You can give a one-time gift. Luxury Cigar Club. Don't forget about those guys. They got the core line. They also have a, another line. Those cigar clubs are super great ways to try new cigars. And if you're really trying to inspire somebody to try new cigars, to give them the opportunity to experience cigars a little bit more throughout the season, all of them have bags that come with Bovida in them well, not all of them, but the ones that I just listed, they all come with Bovida in them. And the bag is a humidor in and of itself. It's metal lined. It's going to keep those cigars fresh no matter what. The metal lining here, you pop it open and everything is inside. All your cigars, the Bovida itself, still squishy. You got the cigars. And when, you know, you get to try all sorts of different cigars, I love it. This is one of my favorite ways to try cigars. And this is also one of my favorite ways to give a gift to somebody I know. Some of my friends have seen some of my videos, they've tried some of these subscriptions, they say they're the greatest thing since sliced bread because you don't have to worry about a humidor. They don't have humidors. They weren't cigar smokers until they got into a subscription. And if that sounds like the person you wanna give a gift to this year, that's the whole point of these subscriptions. Give them the subscription that best fits them. You can give a one-time gift. Oh, there's a Stogie Bird. They, they have a thing called Flip Them the Bird. You can give them a one-time gift this holiday season. They're great opportunities, again, to try more cigars. Um, yes, uh, Jason Hathcox had said, can you address the software issue on the Boba Butler on Android phones? I don't know a ton about that, but what I would say is sometimes this boils down to making sure you have the most updated um, Boba app in that platform and making sure that um, you've possibly reset the Boba Butler and repaired them. Sometimes it comes down, down to that Bluetooth kind of power. Each Android phone is different in what type of hardware they put inside a Bluetooth, um, at what type of hardware they put in their Bluetooth uh, capabilities. Obviously, the higher end phones, they're similar to the iPhone. They have like some of the best hardware. Some of the less expensive phones don't. But other than that, if there's problems going on, Bluestream and through the app, through the Butler app, you can ask them, I'm having problems with X, if that's connectivity or whatever and they are going to be able to pinpoint your specific situation because they can see your butler on the back end. They know what it's doing and what it's not doing. So that's the best way to reach out to them um, through the app and say, 
I'm not being able to connect or I have this problem. Um, software updates, I don't have a full video yet. We're still working on those. So as soon as I get those, I've heard your request, I love it. I will definitely try to produce a video that helps. But again, in the world of cigars, we're dealing with a lot of variables and with technology, we deal with a lot of variables as well. So we work through them the best we can. Appreciate you continue asking that question. I'm sorry that I don't have a better answer for that at this point. Again, um, Cigar Club is on. They obviously have a great uh, program. Good Cigar as well has a great program. Definitely check out these cigar clubs. Again, my favorite way to try cigars. Giving the gift of cigars is always enjoyable. And it's the gift that keeps on giving throughout the holiday or throughout the year. Let's make 2020, 2021 a little bit better. Give somebody a subscription. Then you know that they're going to enjoy cigars every month or every other month on you for the holiday season. Or sorry, for the whole season of 2021. I think I was reaching for the Boveda Large Humidor Bag as I shuffle a lot of these things around um, only because I wanted to showcase, especially if you're giving like this Fuente uh, box that has just a beautiful presentation of these cigars. This is the best idea to me is to throw this in the large humidor bag, which then allows whoever you give them to, to keep these in this box fresh for up to a whole year, if not more. This is the way I typically try to age a lot of my cigars. If you talk to people like Pete Johnson and other people, um, even Cuban smokers, they say they like to keep the cigars in the box that they came in. They use cedar in a specific type of cedar because it gives off a smell, allows the cigars to age. Again, great presentation, allows them to keep the cigars, age it for however long you want or smoke them as soon as you can. Entirely up to you. Again, if you guys have any other questions about cigar giving this holiday season, I hope we solve some of those, um, I guess, trials and tribulations of how do I give cigars? The easiest way, again, is to always make sure you have a container like the Boba de Humidor bag that you can put those cigars in when you give them to somebody and you don't have to worry about them screwing it up and ruining that gift because they dry out or because they didn't taste the way they should. Again, let's protect our smoke. Let's protect our passion. Let's make sure these cigars that we give this season are fresh and ready to smoke. That's all that we're trying to showcase here with the Boba de Humidor bag. It's been my number one thing that I include in every gift giving opportunity. Unless I step up to a Boba de Acrylic Humidor to give this season, I typically always just do it with the Boba de Humidor bag. It's much better than a um, Ziploc bag because it doesn't exchange all the moisture. So that's my two cents on how to give cigars this holiday season. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys have a great holiday season. We'll be back next Friday and we'll be here. Unbox Live happens every Friday at noon Central Standard Time. And if you didn't catch this live, you can definitely rewatch it. Obviously, for Boveda and all your Boveda accessories, head over to bovedainc.com. You can get this here. And for you guys looking for a deal and for just sticking with me until the end of this video, if you subscribe on bovedainc.com, which means if you're buying Boveda for your humidor and you say subscribe, I want this stuff every three months, any order over $15 is going to get free shipping every time it ships. So if you say, I want Boveda every three months, it ships free every time, as long as the order is over 15 bucks. That's not hard to do because that's usually just for the size 60. You'll get over the $15 hurdle, you'll get free shipping, and you'll know that you can track your orders through your Boveda Inc. portal, a little bit better than Amazon, I personally think, but that's just me. So anyways, if there's anything else that you guys need, let me know, have a great holiday season. I appreciate y'all for joining me. This wraps it up for the holiday gift giving guide for Bovida Inc. 2020.